Hey everyone, we're here at Hollywood Park Casino, Chaos at the Casino 2. Uh, we're going to talk to Sevak Ohanjanian, the first fighter of tonight. Just want to ask him a few questions, see what his thoughts are for the day and what it took him to prepare for the fight. Uh, Sevak, uh, thanks for being us with us today, man. Uh, just tell us real quick what it took you to prepare for the fight today and what are your thoughts about it, man, please. Had a great camp. My coach is fighting today. One of our guys, Gabriel, is fighting boxing. All of us trained together, you know, other guys came in the gym, just everybody felt good, everybody motivated, just great atmosphere at the gym. So good preparation, feel great, and hoping for the best. What, what are your expectations for tonight as far as how many rounds are you going to go or like any uh, crazier than usual expectations that you have for tonight for us? It's going to be three rounds. I hope to finish it quick. Uh, you know? you want to win it by knockout? Is that what you're going for? Always, or just always, the always want to win by knockout. But, you know, you, never, you can never underestimate your opponent. You got to do your best and take it how it goes. And if I can knock him out, I'll knock him out. If not, I'll win the decision. Well, we wish you the best, Sevak. Make us proud, man. Thanks for being us with us today, man. Hey, everyone. It's always good to see a familiar face in the crowd. You know, we got uh, DJ Benno. Uh, we just want to ask him a few questions, see what his thoughts for the day are. Benno, it's always good to see you, man. You know, uh, let us know what your thoughts of the day are and what you think, what you expect. Just a few sentences, you know, that's it. Well, I'm hoping not to get knocked out by anybody today. <laughs> that's number one. Yeah. Security, I brought my security with me. <laughs> He's sitting here just in case things go bad. But yeah. it's going to be an interesting night. Um, last time it was amazing. This time it's going to be even more amazing. And, you know, shout out to all the guys putting the kid together. Amazing job. And awesome. You guys uh, enjoy it. Thank you. Uh, as always, we know you have a purpose for being everywhere that you're at, but just a few quick words as far as what you are doing today. Uh, would you please tell us about that? Today, I'm actually making sure after everybody leaves, I'm cleaning up. <laughs> I'm wiping the floors, so <laughs> just putting all the chairs back. That's my job today. Awesome, awesome. Well, we appreciate you, man. Thanks a lot for all your work. Good to see you again. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here with George, the main promoter of tonight's evening chaos at the casino, Hollywood Park. George, one question, man. What's going on, man? I see you running around back and forth. I know you're involved a lot with fighters. I know you promoted this fight. And just let us know what's going on, man. What's the theme of the show? It's chaos at chaos the casino. Chaos at the casino. You, you, you look like chaos, man. You're chaos. causing chaos, man. You know, uh, I want to say great event, man. You put out a, a lot of great fighters out there, man. We're here to support you guys. And uh, just let us know what's next for you, man. I mean, I know you're busy with other things, so what's going on there, man? Well, I mean, the whole, you know, the whole prospect of this idea was to get, you know, to get as many as our brothers to fight on the show. But you know, unfortunately, you know, I had a uh, uh, Sevak Magakian who is very tough to match make because you know he's he's a top of the line fighter oh, yeah. right now. So you know, the guy deserves to be in the UFC. That's why it's so hard to match him up. You know, you got Alfred Kashakian, his opponent sadly got hurt. But, you know, the whole idea of this whole show is just to, you know, bring everybody together, do a good show, get all the guys some wins, you know, just bring the Armenian, bring the Armenian people some good fights, not just the Armenians, you know, just, just an MMA and bring everybody, all the boxing. Crowd. Diversity, man. Diversity is what exactly. we need, man. George, well, if anyone can do it, man, that'll be you, man. We have some great expectations from you. You have proved to us that you could do it, man. Good luck to you and everything that you do, man. Thanks for being with us today, man. Thank Appreciate you it. Everything. Thank you, Artu. TV and everybody. Thank Thanks, you. Robert.
We're here with Sevak after the fight, after his crazy win. Uh, Sevak, uh, what were your thoughts during the fight, and uh, what were you feeling, man? Was it was it too easy for you? Was it what you expected, or this was like a walk in the park for you? Just your thoughts, real quick, please. Uh, I've been out the game for two years. I haven't fought for two years. I just came back. I was doing the school and everything. I came back. I was rusty. I knew I could finish him earlier. I got him a couple of times. I was waiting for him to go out. He wouldn't go. He was hard at it. I looked at his corner. I thought they're gonna stop the fight. They didn't. First, second round, you know, he kept going. Third round, I'm like, I go, for, I gotta go for it all. And I just let it rip and I got yeah. I I noticed during the like, well, towards the second round, you know, you were almost about to get him down on the floor. I mean, yeah. what what was the reason that you couldn't get that? Was it because you're tired or? No, I wasn't tired at all. I just like, I kept seeing him go, but he would come back. I was just, and I'm not I didn't want to, like hit him when he was down, whatever. You know, I was just waiting for him to go, and he wasn't going. Third round, I came. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna make him go and yeah. Uh, what are your thoughts about him as a fighter? Was he a competition for you or well, what? What was uh, I mean? What was the difficulty in the fight for you? Was it just like level off? Not the same skill as I am. And ah, uh, someone just got knocked out, my friend. Yeah. And yeah, he's just hard headed. Yeah. Well, Sevak, congrats on your win, man. I hope you win more and more in the future, man. Thank you so much. You look great. Thank you. Professional Mu Muay Thai fighter Tigran Martirosian. Tigran, first of all, I would like to congratulate you on your win. Uh, I would like you ask, tell us real quick your thoughts after the fight and what kind of training it took to prepare yourself for this fight, please. I mean, my thoughts, uh, I feel very happy I won the fight, you know, unanimous. Um, the way I prepared, we did about a month and a half training, twice a day, five days a week, and uh, two hours in the morning, two hours at night. Was the fight what, what you expected or was it any different? Uh, what about that? I mean, the win was expected. Uh, hopefully, I was hoping for a knockout, um, but uh, unanimous is still good for me. You know, it was great. It was a good fight. Well, you're 7-0 now. Let's hope for more wins for you to come, man. Thank you so much for being with us today, and congratulations, Thank man. You. Thanks a lot. We're here with Alfred Khashakian. You know, Alfred, thanks for joining us kind of late today, man. But let us know what's going on, man. You were supposed to fight. Everyone came expecting you to fight today. So what's the reason that got canceled last minute, man? Let us know, please. I don't know. It was like four days ago. I got, um, I got a call from the promoter, George. He said my opponent got injured, supposedly. But I don't know what really happened. Maybe he couldn't make weight. So it was a last minute thing. We didn't have time to find another opponent, you know, so we just had to cancel it out, you know. Well, at least at least it's not your mistake, man. At least it's not your fault, man, because we know we're, you're always ready to fight. You train hard. So when is the next fight for you, man? When is that going to happen? When are we going to see you up there, man? Thanks a lot, man. We'll be up there next month for sure. We're going to try to find an opponent as soon as possible, ready to go. I'm always in the shape, you know. Just and right now I'm here to support the other high fighters. Hopefully everybody does good, you know. Trying to see Edmond tonight, knock somebody out today with the knee again, you know. Well, we believe in you, man. Good luck to you, man. Thanks Thank for you, being man. with us today, Thanks man. Appreciate yeah, it. You too. Ladies and gents, we're here with the famous UFC fighter, professional MMA fighter, Jerry Papazian. Jerry, thanks for being with us here today, man. Chaos at the casino too. Uh, what are your thoughts about today, man? What's going on? I mean, I see you here. I see you supporting our fighters. Let us know, man. What's going on? Yeah, I'm here. Uh, you know, George, he's put on a great show. Uh, his last show was a, a hit. This is a hit as, as well. Um, I have a lot of friends fighting tonight. Uh, Edmund Trevinian, he's fighting. Uh, Rob Gooch. Um, uh, Sevok, he fought. He won tonight. Travis Gartlitz. Uh, 
Damien, he's fighting. A lot of people that I know are fighting, and it's, well, I'm excited to see the fight. It's always great to see you, man, but uh, what's going on with your career, man? When are we going to see Jared in the ring again, bro? In the uh, octagon, my bad. I, I just fought last Saturday. I, I lost the decision, uh, but I won fight of the night. It was a good fight. Um, I'm going to take some time off and uh, work on a few things. Sometime next year, maybe? Next year, for sure. Yeah. Awesome, man. Well, it's always good to see you, man. Good luck in your fights, man. Hey, Thanks for being with thank, us today, bro. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, man. Have a good one.
լայնակիցներ այսօր մեր կողքին է հալիվուդ փարք խզինոյում արդ հովանիսյանը բոլորի շատ քաջայտնի բռնսկա մարտիկ արջան մի քանի խոսքով ներկայացնես այսօրա քո մասնակցությունը մեր իվենթում ինչպես նկատեցի այսօր քորնրում դու տալիս էր քո խորուրդները որը շատ զգացվում էր իհարկե մի քանի խոսքով քո մասնակցության մասին իհարկե ես նույնպես այսօր վա այս երեկոյին պատրաստում եմ մենք բոլորը ստաղաներով պատրաստում ենք չգիտեմ ինչպես տակարագործս չներկայացավ գալ այդպես ասել մեծ ուրախություն կունենա եւ մասնակցեի ես կան հայ երկրպակ ուներ կունենա բայց տաղաներին օգնում են որպես մարզիչ օգնական որովհետեւ իմ մարզիչը էդմոն թարվեջյանի ինքը կփելու է հա իսկ արջան քո խորտները ինչում օգնեց ինչով օգնեց մեր այսօրվա մարզիչինը մարզիկին գիտեք ոնց հա մարզիկը ինչ անում է ռինգի մեջ ինքը ինչ սխալներ որ անի կարելի ասես ճիշտ ասել մարզիչը կողքից ավելի շուտ է տեսնում եւ դու երբ կողքից տեսնելով հուշում ես դա արդեն գործին ակին օգտատ ինչպես տեսանք հաղթեց մեր այսօրվա մարզիկը նենց որ երևի շատ տեղին էր ձեր խորհրդները արջան իսկ ինչ որ սпасում է քեզ անից գիտենք որ փետր վարին դու կրիվ ունես մի քանի խոսքով դրա մասին նաև խնդրում եմ այո փետր վարի 22-ին WBA վարկացի գոտու վարկացի համար առաջին համարի համար կպնելու եմ կանադացու հետ հուսով եմ սпасում եմ մենակ քանտրակտին որ բայց իսկ կոնկրետը օրը այսինք ասեցիք փետր իսկ եւ որ տեղ է գտնվելու մորանգո կազինոյում մորանգո կազինոյում արջան շատ ուրախ են նորից կրկին որ մեր կողքին ես շատ հպարտանում են քեզանով շնորհակալություն հաջողություն ցավը Մարտին ջան ուրեմն այսօր նախ շնորհակալ ենք որ ներկայիք մեր կողքին իսկ հետո ինչ մասնակցությամբ եք այստեղ գտնվում եւ ապագայում ինչ է սпасվում ձեզանից այսինքն մենք ինչ որ տեսել ենք միջև այսօր ձեզանից այդ անով բավարարվենք թե ինչ որ նորություններ կլինեն ձեզանից հետ Ես այստեղ գտնվում եմ մեր հայ մարզիկներին որպես իրանց կողքին լինելով եւ օգնում եմ նրանց ամբշա մարտը թե UFC մեջ UFC կրողներին թե ասենք MMA ամեն խառ մենամարտերի համար օգնում եմ մեր հայ մարզիկներին եւ միշտ իրանց կողքին եմ լինում կարևոր չի խառ մենավարտ բռնսկա մարտ եւ ամբշա մարտ ես սիրում եմ սպորտը եւ լինում եմ մեր հայ մարզիկների կողքին եւ ցանկանում եմ իրանց հաղթանակ շատ շնորհակալ ենք իսկ կոնկրետ ձեր հետ կապված ինչ որ նորություններ կան դեռ սпасվում են թե այսինքն դուք դեռ զբաղվում եք ձեր մարտով ես ունեի վնասված ունեի ցնկային վնասված որը մեծ վնասված է եւ հիմա արդեն կամած կամած լավանում է օպերացիայից հետո կարծում եմ ուշ տարի արդեն լրիվ ապակ հիված կլինի եւ փորձենք մեկ անգամ մեկ տարի էլ փորձենք եւ դրանից հետո կանցնենք մարզչական գործով շատ շնորհակալ ենք մարտին քեզ էլ մաղթում ենք հաջողություն ապագայում շնորհակալություն հաջողություն
Edmond, thanks for being with us today. Just want to ask you a few questions as far as what took you to prepare for the fight and how do you expect to win the fight today, please? Mm, you know, I'm ready, training with good fighters. My sparring partner around the house, so she got me ready. I'm ready to fight. Uh, what kind of, uh, what type of training did you have to go through specifically for this fight? Was it any different than your fights before, or it's just the same routine training for you as well? So it's the same thing. You know, I train, I train hard for every fight, and I'm ready. Awesome. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Uh, make us proud. <laughs> Thank you. Joining us at Chaos at the Casino too is Andronik, the professional MMA fighter from SK Golden Boys. Andronik, thanks for joining us today, man. In a few words, let us know why you're here, who you're here for, and uh, about your future uh, trainings for your future fights, man. Let us know what's going on. Well, first of all, I'm here uh, to uh, support this great event, uh, support all the Armenia fighters that, that are fighting today. I'm cornering Edmund Tarvidian tonight, uh, I think main event tonight. Uh, I'm his wrestling coach at SK Golden Boys, so I'm here to support him and all the Armenian fighters in this great event. Thanks for being with us today, man. Thanks for your support, and uh, let us know what's going on with you as far as your fighting career, man. Do we Are we going to see some more of Andronik in the ring anytime soon? Uh, God willing, 2013. God. 2013. All right, man. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Thanks for being with us today, man. Good luck to you. Thank you. Ladies and gents, we're here at Hollywood Park Casino with Manny Gamborian, professional UFC fighter. Manny, thanks for joining us. Thanks for being with us today, man. Few words, what's going on? Why are you here? Who are you supporting? Let us know what's going on with your fighting career, man. Ah, uh, man, I'm just here for my boys. You know, my, uh, my boxing coach, Edmund Tavernian, is fighting. The rest of the guys are fighting Armenian guys while supporting Armenians, you know. Just hanging out, just chilling, you know. That's about it. What about you, man? What's, what's coming up for you, man? We kind of heard a few things about you last time when I interviewed you. You said you have a fight coming up pretty soon. As soon as you have that thing going, set up for you, man. What's going on? Let us know. Yeah, it's all set up. It's all set up. I'm uh, fighting February 23rd at the Honda Center, UFC 157, with Chad Mendes. Chad Mendes, wow, okay, and uh, so Honda Center, February 23rd? February 23rd. Hey man, what's, what's the type of training that you go through nowadays to prepare for the fight? Anything different? I mean, you know, uh, I was trying to train the same, you know, I have two months camp, feeling healthy, good, strong. Uh, we want a lot of wrestlers, a lot of boxers, a lot of Muay Thai guys, you know. Like exactly my same camp, how it goes all the time. Uh, so. Last time, last time when we talked, you said uh, you're taking it easy a little bit, but uh, you're gonna start training hard. Uh, did you do what you planned on doing for this fight, man, or uh, what's wh as far as that? Uh, what was your preparation process? I don't understand easy training. I always go hard, so I've been training for many years, and I always go hard, so I'm not trying to you know slow down. So this fight is a big fight, so I gotta step on there, you know, do my best and get a W. So we're gonna get to see a good fight from you that day. 100%. Hey man, wish you the best of luck, man. Thanks for being with us today, Manny. Good luck.